Well, teens and preteens, they face a lot of pressure to fit in. And one organization on the Treasure Coast proving that everybody's not doing it. And here to talk more about the organization, Executive Director Sonia Dupree and Whitney Jean, a student with the group. Let me first say that this group is so special to me because I've done a lot of work with you all. You amazing things. I've witnessed it firsthand. But I'll let you explain just more about the organization, how End It came about. Sure. So End It is an acronym for Everybody's Not Doing It. And we're a 501c3 to help prevent at-risk behaviors in middle and high school students, so preteens and teens, uh, primarily based in St. Lucie County. Um, we provide after school and summer programs um, using the arts as positive alternatives. Mm -hmm. So um, we have done uh, our eight week summer program. We always do a big musical at the end. We also do academic enrichments to help prevent summer learning loss. Okay. And then we have the year round after school program, which also has performing arts, um, visual arts, uh, instruments, piano, everything that students need in that age bracket that is often underserved mm -hmm. because they are teens. So. Right we work hard to keep them positively engaged. And we're looking at some video right now of your facility. Look, you have music equipment. Yes. You have so many resources there to help out these teenagers. You do plays. I went to one of your recent plays. And talking about an event coming up, there is a mystery dinner that is happening. And Whitney, let's have you explain a little bit about that. Are you involved? Yes. All right, so what's um, happening with that? Um, my role, I'm playing as Lady Wellington. She's like a arrogant character, but she's very caring for her groom, which is Sir Nicholas. Uh -huh. um, and it's, it's just a great time, right? People come eat dinner and you all entertain them with this yes. mystery. Whitney, tell me a little bit about how this has helped you, this whole program, End It in general, what it means to you. It, uh, and it is like a really safe environment and it's very positive. It's like something you can look forward to and I love going there. Yeah, and I've met so many of you all. You're so bright and so vibrant. Sonia, with this, it's a fundraiser, correct? Yes. So correct. what do proceeds go toward with this Pro dinner? Yes, proceeds go towards um, providing full and partial scholarships for our students that attend. So we serve um, low-income students. Um, and it's on a side and scale, so everybody pays what they can afford, okay. whether that's a full scholarship or a partial scholarship. Uh, we also are running out of space. So um, for the summer, we do have a wait list. And um, even for the after school, we're, we're, we're kind of budging out of the wall. So we are starting a campaign to also um, be able to get a larger space. And we hope you can get that help. Again, firsthand, yes. I've seen everything that you all have done. Is there anything else that you want to tell people that we left out? I um, just would like to would love to invite them to the mystery dinner. It's on November 18th. There's a 2 o'clock p.m. show and a 7 o'clock p.m. show. You can get more information on our website, everybodyisnotdoingit.org. Okay, at that is in there. Is in there, yes. yes. Everybodyisnotdoingit.org. Okay. Awesome. When you, look, you see all of the details right there. We're going to make sure we put something on our website so people can refer to that. In the meantime, again, we've covered you all extensively. If you're interested yes. in learning more, just go to our website, type in everybody's not doing it. Natalie. All right, Steven.